Greetings to all Mario fans, we can now play Mario and Luigi Brothers Shape game and enter the Switch game into our PC and the application that we'll need to install into our PC is called Fujinx. So this is how Fujinx emulator looks like you can play switch games into your pc as long as you have all of these files here so to show you proof that i have the game and it runs in region so i'm just gonna try to boot up this game into the title screen but i cannot show you a gameplay because that will make nintendo angry and that my videos will be taken down if i showed you that so once i'm in the title screen i'm just gonna stop the emulation from there and also here i'm just gonna blur the screen from here on out so that nintendo will not be able to hit me with any of their copyright strikes into my channel once i'm in the title screen i'm just gonna stop the emulation again. Okay, so I hope you guys do understand on that part. And as you can see here, I am the title screen. So I'm just going to stop the emulation here. The game runs well in Ryujinx. So um, if you want to know how to set up and optimize this game, so this is the perfect video tutorial for you to watch now. Right, but before that, I need you to agree that you own a Nintendo Switch console, you own the physical hardware, and also you own a physical copy of Mario and Luigi Brothership game. And then you have dumped that game into a digital file format. So once you agree to do this, you can proceed on this guide. So first of all, what you need is that you will need to have all of these files here that I have in my desktop. You will need to have the Nintendo Switch keys and the Nintendo Switch firmware. Both should be in version 19, which you got from your modded Nintendo Switch console. Because if you have modded your Nintendo Switch console, that means that you have full access into your Nintendo Switch system files. And all I have to do is just look for all of the keys and firmware files on the Switch and transfer them into your PC. And in order for you to get the game, there is no other way around this, but you should purchase the game legally, own a physical copy of the game where and you have purchased it from a physical store, and then you have dumped that game into an NSP file format or XE file format. And also you will need the Ryujinx application installed into your PC. So to get all of these files, first we need to get Ryujinx first. So to get Ryujinx, uh, just open your browser and just type in Internet Archive because we cannot get a Regex emulator officially now from Regex. So just go to archive.org. So just uh, type in Regex emulator in the search box. And then we'll need to change some in the filters here. So just go to software setting in metric type, then 2024 for the year and look for version 1403. So there are files that have lots of views and downloads. So be sure to get those files and get a copy of them into your PC. Now, sometimes uh, Internet Archive is down. You cannot access the site because they always been have been DDoSed or hacked. So you cannot access them. So I have prepared an alternate link. But this alternate link is for those that own a Nintendo Switch console and own the hardware and the physical copy of Mario and Luigi Brothership game. So if you don't own these things, then do not use this um, alternate link that I have prepared because this uh, alternate link is for those who don't know how to dump their game and don't know how to mod their Switch. So. Uh, in order for you to get all of these other files here, which includes Regions Simulator, I have prepared a QR code here. So I'm just going to put a QR code here in the screen and you will need to scan this into your QR code reader into your mobile phone so that you will be redirected to the page wherein you can get all of these files. So be sure to take note of the files that have highlighted here at my desktop and be sure to get a copy of them into your phone and then transfer them into your PC. So once you have all of these files, let's install them now. So first of all, we need to open Ryujinx uh, zip file for the Ryujinx emulator. Open that, create a new folder and name it Ryujinx emulator or Ryujinx. And then just select all the files that is inside. Just drag and drop these files or copy and paste these files into that folder and just run the Ryujinx.exe from there. So I'm just going to close in this because I have Ryujinx already installed into my PC. Now. The next step is to install the Nintendo Switch keys and the Nintendo Switch firmware. So just go to file, go to open Regex folder, open the system folder, open the keys as a file in the desktop. So just drag and drop the product keys and title keys inside here, copy and paste them. It's done close in this. Then go to tools, install a firmware, install a firmware from XCR zip file. I had to select the firmware file version, version 19, hit open. Also, you see, you have to install this. Uh, version yes and we'll say successfully installed 
you'll know that it's successful because right down here below it says system version 19 and it's the same as on nintendo switch keys and on nintendo switch from so uh the next step now is that we will need to optimize our using some layers so that we can play mario and luigi brothership with no graphical glitches crashes black screens um audio issues into our playthrough and to do this just go to options and go to settings and in this part just be sure to pause the video and copy every setting that you see here so these are my settings for the general tab the game directories is where in will store or switch games and it could be anywhere into a PC as long as it's in XCI or NSP file format. Then you can take input, so it's better to use a controller rather than mouse and keyboard. That's why I've connected my Nintendo Switch Pro controller. So if you have an Xbox or a PlayStation controller, connect them here, map them up according to liking. But the dead zone for both left and right sticks, you should change those into point or 20 or 20 percent. And check on dock mode here. Keyboard and hotkeys, no need to change system just be sure to check on vsync and fs integrity checks in cpu go for check on pptc and host and check in graphics go to vulcan api preferred gpu dedicated graphics card at least you have htx 1060 features and enhancements enable shader cache and enable micro hle resolution scale two times resolution so that the game will look much sharper and much more beautiful than the native resolution of the Switch. But if you're having performance issues, just, just change this back to native. And if you have a powerful CPU and graphics card, you can go for 4K resolution. Now for anti-aliasing, set this to SMAA Ultra. Scaling filter FSR set to 100%. And astrophy filtering set to auto. Aspect ratio 16 by 9. Graphics backend multi everything should be on. Now go to audio settings. So uh, audio backend is in SDL2. Volume 100%. Network, if you want to play local multiplayer, so these are the things that you need to change. Hit apply and hit OK. Congratulations, your Regex emulator is now fully optimized to run and play in Nintendo Switch games into your PC, such as the old new Mario and Luigi Brothership game into your PC. So, a little bit of disclaimer again I cannot show you a gameplay of this game because we all know how strict Nintendo is and they don't support the Nintendo Switch emulation. See, for the PC, there are lots of YouTubers now. YouTuber videos that have been taken down because of this don't like root drinks at all or use emulator at all that's why i can't show you any gameplay at all and i hope you guys can understand on that part but as long as you follow all the steps that i've shown you and guess in this guy guys then you'll be able to play mario and luigi brothership game easily into your pc so if you have some questions then just leave a comment in the comment section below and i'll try my best to answer all of them as fast as i can thank you for watching see you next time and goodbye for now